Hey there, I'm Jamie and welcome to my channel. So today I am so excited to bring you a Loft new Spring Arrivals try on haul. I specifically went up to the store yesterday so I could try some of the new stuff on and they actually had not even put a lot of it out in the store. It was just on racks and they actually um, pulled stuff and let me see new stuff that they had not pulled out yet. So this was a fantastic try on that I did in store. So I brought it home and I'm going to just show you what I chose and give you some feedback because Loft has done a very good job this season. I do have to say I had a complaint last year. I heard from a lot of other people and from me, I would tell the manager in the store, look, a lot of this stuff is ill-fitting and it's way too big. I can't even wear it. I could always wear their extra smalls and I was going down to like double zeros and double zeros and petites, which is a little bit ridiculous. So um, I'm not that small. I do think that they've corrected some of those issues. Everything I tried on actually fit really well and it was really nice. Even if I had to go down one size, I'm, I'm a-okay with that. It's when you have to go down multiple sizes that it just doesn't make much sense. And so if you didn't try any of their stuff last year, I encourage you to try it now because this season's drop is so fantastic. They have picked up on a lot of the trends that are current for spring, a lot of the colors and the prints, and it's just beautiful and not everything is floral, which is really nice because a lot of times that store is just nothing but floral for spring and it wasn't that way when I went in so I was very 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 pleased and I think you will be too and I will tell you some pieces at the end I'll talk about some things at the end of this um, I'm trying on what I bought and I'm going to show it to you because this is what fit me but I did order a few things online and there's a few things I tried in the store that I thought were fantastic they just didn't fit me so I will touch on those at the very end of this even though you won't see them on me I'll show you some pictures of them online and just kind of help coach you if there's something that you're wanting and let you know how they fit and what they look like. And I do have to say the materials have been really nice. The They feel expensive and nice and that's not always been the case with Loft either. So very impressed. Love everything and I can't wait to show you. And if you love this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing and remember to love your neighbor and be kind. So of course, the first item I wanna start with is this jumpsuit because I love a good jumpsuit and I love the utility jumpsuits and I have not found one that I fell in love with and this one I fell in love with. I did get this in a small petite. So a lot of times when I get their petites in order to get the right length and fit, I have to go up a size from what I normally would wear. And so that wasn't the case last year where I got a double zero petite in a pant, which was kind of crazy. Um, but this fits really well. It's really comfortable and I love the wide leg and I got the petite because I didn't want to have to hem it. So if you're 5'4", which I'm 5'4", if you're 5'4 or below, definitely go for a petite and you will not have to hem it. It should be right at this length, which is just sitting on top of my ankle bone. And I think this is a perfect length for a wide leg. So you can put a heel with them if you want to, or you can even wear a flat. I'll show it to you with sneakers here in a minute so you can see that. And I love a utility jumpsuit because you can dress it up a bit or you can wear it very casually. And this one is made out of linen and viscose. So it's super comfortable. It's gonna be great for the spring and summer. And you're just gonna wanna throw this on all the time if you get it. And I think the only color it came in was black, but but I think we're going to find a lot of black this season, um, a lot of black and white probably, and then, you know, your lighter pastels and some bright colors as usual. But I really love this, and I love this for now. I think it's going to work really well for a lot of different things and something that I can throw on during the day and just wear in my office. And you can see the pockets. They did a great job on the buttons. They blend really well. I always look at the buttons on the garments at Loft because sometimes they can be a little bit too yellow. Like a lot of their white button down shirts or button up shirts, I do not like the buttons on them. So I usually don't get them if they look too yellow and cheap and I don't like to replace buttons. I don't have time for all that. So um, this I thought looked really good. It looks expensive and it's just a really really nice piece if you love wearing jumpsuits like i do and i did want to mention that i think you could also replace the belt to this and make it look a little bit more dressed up and so if you wanted to do that i think that's great but if you just want to wear it casually you can wear just the belt the tie belt that comes with it which i think 
is fine. I just kind of put mine to the side. I don't like them right in front on my tummy. Um, so I just put it to the side and made a little bit of a little bow out of it, but you could also just do a knot and it would work just fine. So I usually wait until the end of my videos to put the dresses in, but today I wanted to put the dresses first because we have Easter coming and I think these two dresses that I brought home are so great for Easter and this is my first choice. I think this is probably the one I am going to be wearing and I absolutely love this little dress. It is so just so flattering and so cute. I love how it just comes in in the waist and it has the tie, but I also love the little flouncy skirt that has just these little um, cut-ins where they did such a good job here. Um, I wish I could show you. I'll show you on camera somehow, but it is just so swingy and adorable that I just feel really good in this dress and it, it's just a lot of fun to wear. And I love that the sleeves are very sheer, but the dress actually has a really good lining that is a great color that just enhances the peachy pink tones in the dress. And of course I put on the pink shoes because I think that's fun for Easter, but you could wear a nude if you wanted to, and that would look good. And I think that would be my choice, either pink or nude, that would look the best. And I just think it's so much fun. And you could wear this for other times if you were just going out on a date with your husband or out with your girlfriends. I think this is just a really, really fun dress to wear and it fits so good. This is a size zero or extra small. Um, so I would say go your true size in this and it's just, it's just really fantastic. And I'll show you the back. Sorry, my cords there, but it zips all the way up the back and it's really easy to put on and zip up and it's just a really adorable dress and you could also swap out the belt with this one um, but I love the little tie belt if you just want you know you don't want to enhance it too much in the waist but you still want it to look good I think it does that and um, even without the belt it's got a nice little seam here and it already is cinched so you could probably even lose the belt and be just fine. But super cute dress for Easter if you like shorter dresses and the long sleeve. If it's a little bit cool, it'll be good to go. And you could probably even put a really nice knee-high boot if it was cold because <laughs> some people it's still cold on Easter. So you could do just a nude tan knee-high boot with this and that might look really good as well. The second dress that I chose is this navy eyelet dress and it has some beautiful embroidery that's trimmed on the front and on the sleeve and I love the bishop sleeve. It's a perfect length and this is 100% cotton so if you are a girl that likes natural materials this would be good for you. I also love the length and the beautiful A-line skirt that this has on it because I think that this can be worn by all different body shapes and I love the v-neck. It's not too too low for me and I just think it makes the dress really pretty. So this is a perfect Easter dress in my opinion, especially if you want something that's a little bit more conservative and still looks really, really cute on. So um, this is a perfect dress in my opinion for that. Plus you can wear it for many, many other things. I think the only thing it's missing, which Loft doesn't do that often, are pockets. Um, I love a good pocket in a dress, but maybe they don't put them in their dresses because uh, it's probably a little bit more expensive and a little bit more work. But I do want to mention too the buttons because I told you Loft's buttons are what I always look for and the buttons on this dress go a little bit more brown so they're a darker um, kind of pearly tortoise shell and they are beautiful with the navy. If they were in a lighter color I think they would absolutely take away from the dress and make it look cheap but these actually enhance the dress and make it look a little bit more expensive because you don't really notice the buttons. So when you notice the buttons, they're either really, really good because they look really expensive or they're just really awful. And so I think on garments like this, they should kind of just blend in and go away. And I think that's what happens here. And you really notice how cute the dress is. You don't really notice the buttons. And I also wanted to mention, this one is a little bit looser than the other dress that I tried on, even though it has this same um, seam at the waistline where it comes in a bit so you get that a little bit exaggerated a line at the bottom and if it's a little bit too loose for you I still think a belt would work too just to add to the dress if you wanted find one that kind of blends really well or goes with your shoes I think um, so that would be a good option if you want it to be cinched a little bit more but I still think it's really flattering like this and it's really really comfortable okay so I could not walk out of the store without a pair of these printed pants 
One, because the kind of pajama pant and pajama outfit look is really on trend. And I don't want to look like I'm wearing pajamas, but I always love the prints on pajamas. I think they're always so much fun. So when you find something like this, it would be a great kind of trendy piece to add, but find one that actually goes with your wardrobe. So there were two options. One was a green option that I thought was super cool and I loved them on, but I thought the black and white would be something that I I could pair more things with and so I chose the black and white I know they are really out there but trust me on this they are so so cute and comfortable so they have an elastic waistband so I mean you just really slip them on and go this is something that I would love to wear in the springtime with just a t-shirt so I just have on a black t-shirt from there I love their t-shirts they always do a great job on their styles being very modern and this one just has the shoulder that comes out and it's just really flattering and pretty and so um, it looks a little bit more dressed up I think with the pants and I put on a heel with these because the petite was too short in the pants even if I went up a size they were still too short and if I'm wearing a wide leg pant that's not supposed to be cropped I want it to be longer and so I might get these hemmed so I can wear them with sneakers because I think this with sneakers would be so adorable and you can see just how pretty they are and they were designed so well they have pockets so they're very leisurely feeling but look pretty dressy so I think you could dress them up or you could dress them down and wear them very casually. If you wanna wear them around your house like you would your pajamas, you could also do that. And I just think they're so fantastic. And I'm glad they did something like this. I think they, they actually created some coordinating tops, which I didn't see in store. So um, not everybody is going to be matchy-matchy like that, but if you want the top that matches with it, I do think it would be adorable. So I'll link that for you as well if you wanna check it out. But thought these were fantastic and just something different that you could add to your wardrobe. I would just choose something like this that mixed in really well that you could do a lot more things with as opposed to just buying the pants and only and you're only able to wear one or two things with them. Okay, so I just had to put them on with sneakers just so you could see how cute they would be with sneakers. Now, these can be hemmed because you see the stripes at the bottom of the pant. That actually is sewn on, so you could actually have them um, take that off, hem them up, and put it back on so you wouldn't lose the look of the hem of this pant if you're like me and the petite just didn't work and it was too short. So this is really cute with sneakers and I swapped out to the white tank top that I also got and it's a really, really thick white so it is absolutely not see-through and I love it. I love it when I can find a really thick white that I can wear underneath things or just by itself and this one is really good. And then this jacket. <laughs> I mean, I am such a jacket fiend. I love jackets and blazers, and anytime I can find a good one, I snatch it up. And this one, let me just tell you, it's the best bomber jacket, hands down, that I have seen in these past couple of years. It's made out of linen and viscose, so it's perfect for the spring and summer. It comes in black and tan, and it's just fantastic. It also comes with, you can buy a pair of pants that go with it, or you can buy the cargo skirt, which is adorable. And if you don't mind doubling up on pockets, then I think it'll be really cute. I actually tried the skirt on in store, and of course, the zero and the regular was too wide in my hips. And so I ordered the zero petite to see if maybe it would take the hips out a little bit. And I, of course, it's going to be shorter, so I may not like it, but I'm definitely going to try it. I have ordered that and it should be here in a couple of days because I paid for expedited shipping. But I just have to say, this is fantastic. It looks really expensive. The buttons blend really well with it. And the pockets are not obtrusive. They just kind of blend in with the jacket. So this is the best bomber jacket. If you have not gotten one, snatch this baby up in black or tan. And I have a feeling these are going to sell out pretty quickly because they are that good. And you can wear them with the pants. I thought it was cute with the pants or with shorts or jeans or over a dress, whatever you want to do. But 
definitely this jacket is fantastic. And then if you put it with the matching pieces that go with it, like the pant or the skirt, you'll have a great kind of two piece set that will take you a lot of different places. Um, I have a couple more that I'm going to show you that um, I have to put on. There's actually three more pieces. And then I'll talk to you about the things that I actually didn't get that I thought were really good at the end of the video. So this might be a really long one. I hope you stick around and check out everything because if you need stuff for spring um, or just want stuff for spring, this is a really good time to get them. And they're actually really, really good pieces. So I do want to tell you about the earrings I have on because I think they are so special. And it's these right here, which it's a very big stud that is actually a replica of some vintage earrings. And I have been looking for studs like these for years and have not been able to find them. And I stumbled upon these um, on Anthropology's website. And then they had these in the store when I went yesterday and I got them. But they are fabulous. They These are the clear crystal. The ones online, you can get coral, a green, or a blue. And they are just so fantastic i mean i was so impressed and they've been really comfortable and i'm going to wear them casually or dress them up but really really cute if you want something that has that vintage flair um they're not super expensive and i say get every color if you love them but i wanted to tell you about them because i just think they're so cool so this next piece is this cardigan that has the black stripes on it this also came in some other colors that were solid and the reason why I loved this is because one, it's something that you wear as a top. I guess you could open it up and put a tank top underneath it if you wanted to, but I really love these as tops. I think they're really comfortable. I think they're a little bit cuter than cardigans. I'm not a huge cardigan fan, although I have become more of one in the past year with some of the oversized cardigans and things. I actually wear them around the house a lot because they're so comfortable. But this one, I think you could dress up or you could wear it really casually. And I really loved the striping on this. I thought it was very flattering the way they did this just in the center of the sleeve and the center of the body. And I just thought it was very flattering and it's so lightweight and comfortable. So it's that perfect piece for spring and even early summer that you could put with white jeans like I did here, or you could even put it on with your cutoff shorts or some other cute shorts that you might have. Some black shorts would be really good with it too. And I think I would do my slim straight black jeans that I have with this a lot right now too. So this is something you can wear now and then you can continue to wear it and switch up your bottoms with it. But I have on these white jeans, which are mine from J. Crew, but I wanted to talk about the jeans that I found at Loft that they didn't have my size in. So they have a white kick flare that I thought was so adorable. It fit really well. And the 24 was a little snug. I don't like my white jeans to be that snug. So I would need a 25 in it, which is my normal size. So definitely buy your normal size. Or if you don't want it tight at all, I would go up a size, especially in white. But I thought it fit really well. It wasn't super see-through. It just looked really cute. And the length of it was actually really good being it's a little bit cropped and it has that, that kick out at the end, which this is my new favorite jean for all different body shapes. I think it looks really, really good. And I think it's a great option with sandals and sneakers in the spring and summer. So I wanted to talk about those, although I don't have them. I thought they were really good. So the next two pieces are this button up shirt and these cute little shorts. So I'll start with the shirt because it's a little bit um, relaxed. It's not super oversized, but it does have a very relaxed feel to it and it's meant to. So this is an extra small. I got my normal size and I love the color of it and the stripes on it. And I think the buttons still look really good. They are a little bit of that yellow like Loft does, but they blend well with the shirt. So it didn't bother me in this one. And I loved the pocket that had the stripes going in the opposite direction. And then I just rolled the sleeve up because that's what I would do if I was wearing it in spring and summer. And I do love the little detail here. It's a high low fit, so it's longer in the back and it has this little triangle on the side, which I thought was adorable. So I think this top looks really good left out. Although if you don't like wearing tops out like this, then you can just fold the back up tie in the front or even front tuck it if you wanted to or just tuck the whole thing but you will have a lot of bulk back there if you tuck the back tail in so I just roll it up and you know you front tuck the front and it works really well but I think it's cute that it's a little bit longer and then you have the shorts on that are a little bit shorter so they just peek out a little bit and I think that's a really cute look but I love these two pieces this is viscose and cotton so it's super soft and comfortable and the shorts oh I haven't talked about the shorts yet so they have two little 
little pockets on the front, which I absolutely love. And since they're the same color, I think they blend really well. And these feel like a like a denim or a canvas. I'll have to look at exactly what they are, but they, they feel kind of like a denim. But they don't look like denim because it's just a very light blue dye on this material. And I just love the light blue. I thought it was fun. And I'm going to love all the blues that I'm probably going to see this season because blue is supposed to be really big. And they have a very beautiful blue suit. If you want a blazer and a pair of pants that match that are blue, it's gorgeous. I actually tried it on, but the blazer was long so it is a longer blazer and it did not look that great on me but i thought the material and the fit and everything was really good it was a little big so i would size down one size and it looked really expensive in my opinion even the pants so if you want a two-piece suit that is a beautiful blue then definitely check it out so I pulled up my computer here that's on a cart that I use for all my videos and I wanted to just talk about um, some of the pieces that I saw that I thought were good. There's just a few here and a couple of them I have ordered and a couple I tried on in the store, but I didn't want to adjust the camera and mess with it too much. So you're seeing my computer, but I think that's okay. This is just really casual. So the striped wrap shirt dress in olive green is so beautiful. I tried this on in store, but it just didn't fit me well. And and I think if you have a figure that this dress goes for and you want to cinch that waist and show off those hips and shoulders, this is perfect. So hourglass, pear shape, and even uh, rectangle shape, I think are perfect for this dress. And it is absolutely beautiful. And you may want to size down one size in order to get it to fit a little bit better. I think if I had a size down, it would have worked for me. But it was just too loose, which didn't, you can't adjust that um, part that's the faux wrap part you can't adjust it it's attached and they don't allow you to change it so that was a little unfortunate but a really really good dress and then this denim jumpsuit in a vintage wash i hope this is as cute as it looks online when it comes in which i ordered it because of course they didn't have it in my store and it's an online exclusive i can actually sometimes find online exclusives in my store so this is really really cool i love this jumpsuit so i ordered this i can't tell you how it fits but i did order just an extra small in it and then the chambray relaxed blazer. If you want a denim blazer, which I have talked about a ton, I thought this one was really good and it looks like it's going to be really comfortable. So I also ordered this in an extra small. It says it runs a little bit large and it looks like it's got like a 3.3 review on it, but I bought it. I'm gonna try it and see how it works because I thought it looked really cute. So the next item is the drapey cargo pant. I thought this was an amazing cargo pant that you could dress up or dress it down casually. I could not find the right size. I tried the petite and I tried the regular in a zero and it was just a little bit big. So um, I do want to recommend it because I thought it was great if you want a very subtle cargo pant that you could do a lot with. And I loved the camel color, but it comes in whisper white and black and the black would go back really well with the jacket that I showed you. Um, and it also has the cargo skirt, which I talked about, but I think these are a good option if you want something drapey and feels really good. It does have a pleat in the front, so if you don't like pleats, it's not for you, but otherwise, I think it's a really good pant. Also, this little ribbed sweater I thought was so great. If you love these sleeveless style sweaters, this one was really good. The color in the camel did not look good on my skin, and they didn't have the green in store. I just noticed that they have a green online, and it's beautiful. So this is a really good layering piece, or something that you can wear by itself and I thought the quality was really nice and the fit was really nice so if you want something like this this would be a really good pick so thank you so much for watching and if you loved this try on haul please let me know by giving this video a like and also leave me a comment let me know what you loved and don't think about it on me sometimes I buy things that I think are great that you probably would like and if just don't don't think about what it looked like on me although i know i'm your model but um there might be something in here that would look better on you than it does on me and so anyway i wanted to let you know that this also came in the mail i got this in the mail today and it's a great little catalog of a lot of the things i have on and some other great things in here and there's also some 
good little coupons in there that were a little bit more than I've um, had a discount yesterday, which is totally fine. They usually have sales from 30 to 50% off. So if you can at least get 30% off, it's great. But you know, if you want to wait, do the 40 or the 50, but the 50 comes much later and not everything is going to be available. So this is really good stuff, a really good delivery for them. So I do encourage you if you need something for spraying to shop now because the better stuff always comes out earlier. So thanks again for watching. If you love this video again, please give it a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing. That really helps my channel. I'm really trying to get my channel to grow um, without creating videos that are just about the algorithm. <laughs> so hopefully you can give me some support and hit that subscribe button. But anyway, I'll talk to you next time. Thanks for watching.